is James Paul Starlin, and I'm a student filmmaker at the Art Institute of Seattle, working on my bachelor's in digital filmmaking and video production. I'm working on my senior project right now. It's called Meet Me Halfway. It's about an African-American guy and a Filipino girl, and the struggle to be able to find the courage to love one another. I feel like this is a very powerful film. It's a very beautiful story about this good Catholic Filipino girl and how she dreamed of meeting this wonderful, amazing, good Filipino man. But instead, she meets an all-American boy and there's a cultural struggle and she doesn't want to fully give herself. All right, let's roll camera. James and his team is very professional and I've been extremely, extremely impressed. It's been a great journey with them. The student film is the most like a, like a feature film, like a union feature film than anything I've ever encountered in Seattle or, or in the in independent film industry. How much more time do you need, James? Everyone on set is very professional. Everyone on set is very reliable. This film has brought out the best in a lot of people on set. One of the things that has impressed me about the project is the overall organization of the shoot. You know, I've been on shoots that were very disorganized and just um, shoot from the hip and um, I got tired of those. <laughs> when, I, when I showed up on the set, um, I noticed that they were uh, setting up tents. It's not something you see on a student shoot. They're tents. Well, what's going to go underneath those? You know, craft services, food. Wow, look at that. They had grip trucks and they had all the lights you'd ever want. Everything you could ever want on a film shoot. So, really liked it. I want to do it again. We have a great variety of people involved in this film, from professionals, freelancers, all the way to students at the Art Institute of Seattle, Seattle Community College, and Shoreline Community College. I don't think very many students go to this level of production on any student film, and I think all students should have to experience this at some point, just kind of seeing the whole process of making a film. We had a bunch of students that go to the Art Institute. They really worked hard and they were learning. I could see their expression like they're really you know, excited about working on this. I think this is benefiting the students where they can see exactly how a set should run. That workflows really matter. The way you handle and organize yourself really saves time. So I'm actually a fashion major and it's really exciting for me to work with people um, from different areas in their careers. I do wardrobe on the film. I really enjoy it because I love being able to tell a story with the clothes and being able to have fashion as a medium. My role on the film is production designer and it's, it's a very rewarding uh, role actually and it, it's always interesting and, and personally fulfilling to have the whole project come together. My name is Nina Raja Tawira and I'm six years old. It's actually a really fun time doing the movie. We have a lot to get done today so let's all stay on time. I will say that the crew, everybody that's involved, it's, it's a tight knit, it's like a, a, a family. Everyone's pulling their full effort into it, making this project a, a big, uh, a big hit. So I'm excited about it. There's only so much that a book or a classroom can teach you about film. Yeah, you're going to need to have the boom pole more like over there anyway, so you need to make a longer game. The only way you can really learn the practical applications of film is to actually go out and do it. Your senior project is your capstone project, and it's really important that you take this very seriously and that you go for broke. For underclassmen, I would say get to know your seniors and offer your services. Get involved in their work and see how they operate. Being able to get on a, on a student production like this is quintessential um, as far as education goes because you're learning how to work with other people in the real life scenario, in the real life environment. In the classroom, they might tell you to do, a, do a, certain, some, a certain thing a certain way, but when you're actually out there on set and you see why, you're not only learning, but you're doing, so you're learning it in a way that ingrains it in your brain so much better. Let's shoot it. Yep. It looks good. Sexy. Let's make a movie. <laughs> right. Okay, ready? Quiet on set. 
Roll sound. Roll camera. Here we go. Directing this film is very humbling for me because I, I never envisioned having this many people involved and this many people being so excited about something that I wrote and that, that I want to direct. My only hope is that everyone who's been involved, all the 30 people, the PAs, the second ACs, the grips, and everybody who's involved, my hope is that they're learning just as much as I am.